Hey, welcome back to Ramsey Land. Today I want to share with you the reversibility of hydration for copper sulfate pentahydrate. Check this out. For this investigation, I'm using my boiling tube, Bunsen burner, some water in a dropper, my spatula, and copper two sulfate. Okay, to begin, I'm gonna start adding my copper sulfate to my boiling tube. Now, as I do that, remember that this is really copper sulfate pentahydrate, meaning that there are five water molecules for every molecule of copper sulfate. So as we heat that up in our boiling tube, it's going to become anhydrous copper sulfate as those water molecules evaporate out of the compound and it'll turn white. And then we can reverse the reaction simply by adding drops of water and that compound will turn back to this beautiful blue copper sulfate pentahydrate. Let's start the reaction. Okay, now you're ready to start heating up your copper sulfate pentahydrate and you'll start to see it slowly turn white as it becomes anhydrous copper sulfate and those five water molecules per molecule of copper sulfate start to evaporate out of the compound. You can start to see a lot of condensation forming in the test tube as those water molecules begin to evaporate. Okay, the next step is to carefully take your anhydrous copper sulfate and to tap it into a watch glass where you can add a little water and rehydrate it into copper sulfate pentahydrate. So this is the anhydrous copper sulfate and you can see that it is so desperate for water molecules, it's absorbing water from the air and slowly turning blue again. Let's add a few drops of water to see what happens. Look at that, that beautiful blue copper sulfate pentahydrate returns. Look at that. Let's add a few more drops. Such a beautiful reversible reaction. Just fantastic. Let's take a look at this reversible reaction equation. So when you start with CuSO4, that's anhydrous copper sulfate. It's dehydrated, it's white. And when you add water, those five water molecules, that's the five H2O, change it back into copper sulfate pentahydrate. And that's when it turns that beautiful blue. That's the CuSO4 5H2O in this amazing reversible reaction. I hope you enjoyed today's edition of Ramsey Land, and I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed this presentation, be sure to remember to like and subscribe.